Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome. And I am Ali the Ostrich, and it's great to be back with you on this Tuesday. Let me know down below in the comments, what are you guys having for whether it's breakfast time or lunch time or dinner time or whatever time it is, let me know what you're eating. Uh, and I want to dive right in today, guys. Uh, hello, hello, everyone. Welcome. And I am Ali the Ostrich, and it's great to be back with you on this Tuesday. Let me know down below in the comments, what are you guys having for whether it's breakfast time or lunch time or dinner time or whatever time. And let's see who we have tuning in. We have Facebook user Tim So, and you could market premium priced snow in Alaska. I'm guessing this is Robert Murray, who is in my course, Survive and Rise with Live Video. And we have another round coming up, guys, on May 10th. Uh, if you want to start your own live streaming show, oh, and Scott Ayers is tuning in from Agora Pulse. He says, this is disturbing to see in my feed, Scott, but it got your attention, didn't it? Didn't it get your attention? Uh, anyway, guys, I want to dig right in. Today, we are going to talk about how to use StreamYard with Snap Camera to make your live shows more memorable now more than ever and fun, of course. So we're going to dig right in. We're going to talk about what is Snap Camera, who should use it, and why should you use it. And then I'm going to do a tutorial actually walking you guys through five simple steps in order to do everything from download the application to actually use the filters together with StreamYard. And Scott Ayers said he got the notice actually, and boom, there's an ostrich. Yes. There is an ostrich. Now more than ever, there is an ostrich. And thank you, Scott Ayers, for saying my eyes are looking lovely. I really appreciate that. Uh, so guys, uh, so Snap Camera is a virtual camera that you can use together with the amazing live streaming platform, StreamYard. If you guys haven't checked it out already, check out StreamYard. I'll put a link in the comments. Uh, it's an amazing live streaming platform that lets you add branding to your shows. It lets you bring on guests to your shows. Uh, you can even go live straight from your phone using StreamYard, which is amazing. Uh, so that is terrific. And also, uh, for some reason, Facebook is saying that my broadcast is not working. So shout out to Facebook. OK, so the first step, and hopefully some of you guys are still hanging out with me, is to go to snapcamera.snapchat.com and click download. That's pretty simple, right? Let me know in the comments. Is that simple enough for you? You can do it. I know you can do it. Step number two, find the file that you downloaded when you click that download button and install the application. So find it, double click on it, install it on your computer. Step number three, create a new broadcast using StreamYard. And under the settings for cam and mic, which when you create a new broadcast, the settings are down below. Uh, just click cam and mic, then select camera. And under the drop down menu, menu, you will see the options for your regular cameras you use, as well as for a snap camera. So you can select snap camera. Step number four is open the Snap Camera application on your computer. And da, 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 let me share my screen. And we're going to go to Snap Camera so you guys can see what it looks like. Let me know if you guys have any questions so far when it comes to just kind of the process of getting Snap Camera going. Uh, Scott wants to know if you take a drink or pick your nose, does not mess things up like do your wing show? I. I, I don't know. Maybe you should test it out, Scott. Let me know how that works. I would love to know. Haha. -ha. OK. So guys, once you are in StreamYard, you're going to, like I said before, go to cam mic. And then you're going to select camera and select snap camera. Then you're going to open the snap camera application. And this window is going to open up in your, uh, in your broadcast. In StreamYard, OK, so uh, actually not in StreamYard. It would just be on your the window of your computer. 
And then this is what pops up. And these are all fun filters that you can use in your broadcasts. And why would you want to do this? To make them more fun, more memorable, to make people stop in your newsfeed, like Scott Ayers, who got a notification watching because it's an ostrich. Who wouldn't want to keep watching an ostrich? So here are, so I love using this ostrich one. Uh, I'm a fan of Dunkin' Donuts. So here is a Dunkin' Donuts iced coffee cup. You could also do this. Who wouldn't want a pizza that spits out nachos? You could be upside down. You could be Batman. Hello, I'm Batman. And so many other things. Uh, so let me see who is commenting. Scott Ayers says, I need to set an set up an orange wig filter on Snapcam. Yes, you need to do that, Scott Ayers, for sure. Uh, there's just so many different options, guys. I use this on the Shout Out Saturday show with Brian Shulman. Shout out to Stephanie Liu, who let us know about Snapcam. And we get so many questions about how to actually, like, what is this? How are you able to turn into toilet paper or an ostrich or a hot dog or all these different things? So I just thought I'd come on here and let you guys know how to do it step by step. Uh, like I was saying before, guys, also, I have some uh, live streaming classes coming up starting on May 10th. Uh, so if you just go to risewithlive.com slash uh, courses, uh, you can check out. We both have recorded trainings now as well as a few different options for group coaching programs in the Survive and Rise with Live video program. So definitely check that out. Let me know if you're whether you're live or on the replay. Let me know what comments you have. If you have comments or questions after this show, and I'd be happy to answer them. And uh, let me know if you try out Snapcam. If you do, uh, take a screenshot of you using it and let me know which fun filters you decided to choose. Thanks so much for tuning in. Get your face out there. Make an impact now more than ever.